Hello there, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is super exciting because I am doing an update to my whole collection project pan and spoiler, we are rolling out one product, which means we get to randomize another one in, which I love to do. So if you're interested in seeing what I'll be rolling out, then just keep on watching. As always, I will have the creator down in the description box. This is a sort of a collab kind of uh, project. There is a bunch of us that um, just kind of, you know, cheer each other up. We have a an Instagram chat where we chat about our products and other things um, also. But uh, yeah, it's, it's not necessarily that we post on the same day. We just kind of, you know, share our thoughts and share our journey with this uh, project. So let's begin. I'm going to talk about the first product that I have here on my list. I think this has been in here the longest. It is my Wet n Wild Bear It All lipstick. Now my goal is to finish it up. Um, over the past month, I had used this uh, lipstick 14 times, bringing me to a total of um, 72 times. And as you can see, this is all that we have left. Now, it's not finished, unfortunately. I uh, will not be able to roll this out. But I know I said last month that I think I'll be able to roll it out, you know, this month, which obviously didn't happen. But I do think that next month this will be an empty. This is the color. Beautiful, beautiful neutral shade. I use it as a blush and I use it as a uh, lipstick also. Now I have been using it more as a blush because I'm trying to work through the lip products. The other lip products that are in this uh, project, red obviously. Um, so I have been using this as a blush often more often than that um, but I have been loving it as a blush and I am so close you guys so 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 close and uh, I can't wait I think next month is going to be the month that this will be officially an empty next up I have my PS red lip liner and this is what it looks like. Look at how small it is. So, so small. Now, I have been making consistent progress uh, throughout the, the months. And um, by the looks of it, I'm thinking one, maybe two more months. It depends how, you know, how I'll be able to sharpen it. But I have a feeling by next month, this might be done which will be super, super exciting. Uh, let's check numbers. Over the last month, I had used this 11 times for an overall total of 50 uses um, in this project. And I would say maybe 15 more uses and this will be done. <sighs> Imagine, that would be my first, not ever, because I had used up a lip liner before, but it would be um, the first lip liner that I had used up this year. So this is the shade right there, just beautiful, cool toned, kind of true red uh, color. And I love the formula, it's super creamy. I have had this for ages and it still works perfectly fine. Um, I really enjoy it, but you know, it's in this project for a reason and I just want it out because it has been in my collection for so so long next up i have my mac retro matte uh, liquid lipstick in the shade red jade <sighs> you guys know my feelings towards this uh product i don't like it i am kind of leaning towards that i just freaking despise it because it's so drying i really like the color but the formula just sucks it's so 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 bad now i had given myself a goal to use this 30 times um over the last month i had used it seven times for a total of 17 times now if i really put my mind to it i probably would be able to use the additional 13 times um in the next month to roll it out but 
I don't think I'll be able to do it because of how much I don't like this. Once I am done with this in this project, this is going to go into my declutter pile because I just, I don't like it. I just don't like it. Uh, so yeah, 13 more uses to hit my goal. Maybe I'll be able to do it in the next month, but I doubt it. I would say uh, realistically two more months and this will be out realistically but yeah and then after that it's going it's going out of my collection because i just I just don't like it i will show you the color the color is absolutely beautiful it is this kind of watermelon uh red which is so just so so pretty but the formula number one is so so drying and number two when you apply this on your lips it's sheer it it does not cover and yeah i can't afford that I can't afford to have a dud like that in my collection. I just nope. You can actually see windows in this product already, which is you know fun, but yeah, I don't think I'll be able to ever finish it up because of how I feel towards this. The product that was introduced uh, last month comes from my Charlotte Tilbury Filmstar Bronze and Glow palette, and I had rolled in the highlight shade. So this is what the highlight looks like. As you can see, I have a good dip going on in this uh, in this highlight. Now my goal is to hit pan on this, and uh, yeah, I'm just slowly working away on it. I don't think it's gonna happen anytime soon. I would say two, three more months, and then I'll be able to have, maybe by the finale I'll be able to do that. But you know, I'm just enjoying my time with this because it's such a beautiful highlight. It's very subtle. It is the highlight that I'm wearing right now it's just glowy and i can use it as an inner corner highlight or on my face and it just looks beautiful both ways so uh like i said my goal is to hit pan and i had used it 15 times over the last um, month and yeah i'm just gonna work away with it now i don't mind having this having it in this project because i just like the way that it looks on my skin it just looks very beautiful, very smooth, very subtle, yet it uh, gives an impact. I really enjoy it. And uh, the last product is my Shiseido uh, Techno Red um, Lip Lacquer. My goal was to use this 30 times and I am very excited and very happy to say that over the last month I had used it 12 times, bringing me to a total of 30 uses within this uh, project. Now, uh, this was, I don't mind this, um, this uh, lip lacquer. It's basically like a thick lip gloss. This is what it looks like right there. And uh, yeah, it just goes well with all the reds that I already have in this project. So I didn't mind having it. Plus, I actually what I did a couple of times is apply a very sheer layer and then just kind of blot it with my finger and it looked so natural. It looked like my lips were naturally that pigmented, which just looked so, so beautiful. I do enjoy it and I would like to keep it in my collection and potentially uh, in the future pan it because it just looks so, so pretty. And I forgot, I forgot to uh, swatch the actual highlight, the Charlotte Tilbury highlight. So I'm going to give it a swatch there. Now, I, I don't know how well you'll be able to see this because my lights are very bright. Let me turn down the brightness and I have it swatch right there. It's just so glowy, so beautiful. Oh, there you go. And yeah, I just, I just enjoy it. You know, it's, it's a beautiful subtle highlight that, uh, just looks very very pretty so that being said I have hit my goal on one of these products which means that we'll be rolling in um, another one which is so so exciting uh, okay so I have the pretty random app and I also have my spreadsheet uh, ready here so I have 250 five um, eligible products to roll into this uh, project. So I have one through uh, 205 and what I'm going to do is I am going to randomize uh, a number and then you know see what it 
corresponds to in my spreadsheet i have one major rule is that i will only work on one product from each category so i won't be able to work on a bullet lipstick a lip liner a liquid lipstick or a highlight anything else is absolutely fair game so let's just do it let's randomize and the product is 19 the number is 19 okay uh, it's either a foundation or a primer or something like that 19 it's a concealer yeah oh, i am so happy that this is getting ruled in because uh it is the oldest concealer in my collection in my opinion and it is one that i was working in my uh, project pan like a full face project pan that i had a year and a half ago when i was still going into the office it was like you know part of my um makeup let's say makeup uh, bag and you know i would you know it would be a part of a project pan but it would be like a full face of makeup that i would bring to work and you know it would be the makeup that i would use to do my makeup there so let me just pull it out let's mark it let's figure out a goal and yeah let's just yeah let me just pull it i'm so so excited this is i'm so happy that this got pulled in okay so i have it here now unfortunately it was laying on its side so i do not have an accurate marking but i did kind of estimate that this is where um it would settle i will leave it on like you know standing up for it to settle 100 percent. but i think this is more or less what it would be um well the goal is quite simple my goal would be to use it up because i do not have a lot left and yeah once i guess the pump uh, will stop working i will turn it around and use it like that i hope can i even take out the top huh can i unscrew it no oh no so i guess once the pump stops working this is it it will be done and i just messed up probably have nail polish somewhere yeah on my hand <laughs> fucking idiot uh but yeah i'm going to remark it then uh this is more or less where we are goal is to use it up and you guys you have no idea how excited i'm i have been planning to kind of put it into my shop my stash and you know try to work on it but it's a product that or you know i had bought a few concealers that i wanted to try before i put this back in but now i have no choice it's gonna be in a project and i'm so 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 excited so that is it for today's update uh, let me know in the comments down below if you are a part of this uh, project and how did you get on this month did you hit pan on anything did you meet your goals let me know i would love to find out i mean i watch the videos anyway i watch all of them because i just love this project so much uh but you know or if you're doing this on instagram and i don't follow you let me know because i just love 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 this project so much that i um really enjoy uh seeing people's progress but like I said, that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give this video a like. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Mwah.